My name is Linda. Uh, I've been working for MSF for the last uh, six years. When uh, I changed uh, from the admin pool to the, to the Pilco pool, I was already in the position for just a couple of weeks. Uh, my pool manager at that time um, just uh, talked about the mentoring program uh, during our first um, meeting and said that it's really just something to support. And I say, okay, why I will say no to support? First, it's the mentee who choose, I mean, who accept the mentor. Uh, so I think that in that way, it's uh, super comfortable for, for the mentee. We agreed to, to do it two times a month, every, every two weeks, and that the call should not last uh, more than one hour. At the same time, I, I was also sharing with my team that I, I was part of this mentoring program. And they were aware because I was saying, okay, this is my time. I have the call with my mentor, so please uh, do not disturb, except if there is, a, of course, an emergency. At the beginning, we kind of use more like practical things. So I was looking for feedback on some documents that I was writing for the, for the project and uh, proposals. So he helped me on that. Uh, so this was really appreciated at the beginning. And I think the trust starting to, you know, like to, to grow also to reflect on what you are doing, uh, you know, as a, as, as a manager, by him questioning, you know, uh, what I was doing or why I, I did that or why I took this decision and everything, uh, kind of helped me to, to understand or to be more comfortable with the decision I took. Yeah, to have a mentor, it's really give you the opportunity to, to talk freely and uh, to have someone who are just here to help you, to support you. So, and there is no judgment, it's confidential. There was a different time with my mission. Uh, I had to face some uh, incident in the hospital, which actually touched me a lot. It was super hard to, to manage with, uh, with the mother. Um, we didn't have many choices, but this affected me a lot. Uh, so where I just needed to ventilate, and uh, when I had the call with, uh, with my mentor, so I really share um, the situation with him. And um, yeah, he listened to me. Um, he listened to me, uh, which uh, I think was what I was um, looking for. I've been through something tough. Uh, he did too. And we can learn from you know, something from that. I learned that I'm capable of uh, doing things that I was not thinking uh, to be capable of. Even if I was uh, alone, having this position, I had support, you know, on my back. So I'm, I'm sure it helped me to, to, to succeed on this mission. And yeah, it's uh, linked also with the way um, I'm managing my team. I think I'm a better listener, <laughs> actually, for my team to support them um, as much as I can without, you know, stepping too much in their work. Um, I was really trying to, to help uh, the managers uh, at least to, to, do, to have this uh, way of um, step back on what they are doing and reflect on uh, what is what's going on within the team, within the project. So yeah, I will really push the people uh, to be part of it, definitely. Yeah.